so with the car up in the air i can show you that we have the whole front end off now we have everything for the suspension out we're going to be pulling all the control um the steering linkage out next we're probably going to end up replacing the majority of that as well then you can see all of the cooler lines and how they run up to the cooler and then we have a little bit of rubber in between to cushion everything so that could move at one rate and these lines can move at another without breaking the line here we have um unions to put everything together so if he has to take the transmission out he can just disconnect it from there or has anything that he has to do he can disconnect it right from there and get everything out um, and you'll see how nice they run there is the cables for the grounds going to the frame right over here and then we also have the fuel line that we just ran and we put the fuel regulator where the fuel pump used to be because we have an electric pump on the rear. I have also run a new line going over where they narrowed the frame. So you can see the union right over there and the fuel line goes up over the um, frame rail and then comes around to the back and then goes right to the fuel pump right there. You can see it go right around, comes out that way, and then goes back. And again, we have a little bit of rubber in there just to cushion everything so this could move without breaking the fuel line itself. Um, we have the fuel tank out because there was some dirt in it. Kept getting clogged, kept clogging up the filter. So we cleaned it all out. I'll be putting that back in. And then we have the whole front end off and his rotors needed a nice cut. If you look, they had enough meat on them, but you can see how rusty and ugly they are um, and how much glazing they have from the old pad. So we brought them in the back, put them on the brake lathe, and we're giving them a nice cut. And you can see right there where that dirty spot, the dark spot is that keeps going around, that was where the rotor was warped. So we're giving them a nice cut, make them a little nicer, get them all done. And, um, you know, it really needed the front end done. There was a bunch of issues. If you see here, you can see the sleeve and the rubber. There is no rubber left on this side. The sleeve is actually hitting the control arm, which has actually caused this side of the control arm to oval a little bit. So these lower control arms are no good anymore. And then we have this here where somebody, it looks like, was trying to hack this for whatever reason. I don't know, but they were trying to hack this out. So we're going to replace the lower and upper control arm with these over here that we have already rebuilt. Um, new ball joints and all new bushings in those. So those are all ready to go in. We're also going to be changing out to springs because if you look, you can see somebody has heated these springs up to drop them down, to drop the front of the car down. And they did a really bad job at it. <laughs> it's not good. So these springs are actually really dangerous. Um, another problem we had, look at that shock absorber. If you notice, the piston is completely missing out of the shock absorber. When we took the bottom screws that hold it into the lower control arm out, this whole piece just fell out and the piston just stayed in the car. So yeah, we're gonna get them all new, uh, new front shocks for this thing. Um, and then they, to make up for how low they made the springs, they tried putting spacers on the top of the spring. So it's just a really bad, bad thing that they have done to the car. So we're going to fix all that up. We're going to make it safe and we're going to make it right. And again, you can see the positive cable. It's going to get attached with a clip right over here on the bottom of the motor mount. There is a bolt right there and it will get attached to right there. So. We're coming along really nicely with this car. It's looking really good. I can't wait to get her finished, get her started, and get her on the road. Alrighty, guys. 
I will talk to you real soon. Have fun. Okay, bye.